hold on. So you guys have Bronx, Manhattan, Brooklyn, Queens, Staten Island. This is all a part of New York City. Are you learning? Are you learning this right now on stream? Yeah, I'm actually, I'm actually, oh, okay, <laughs> never mind, never mind. We are not learning that. We are here to look at a match between Cookie <laughs> Lamb's Villager versus I think we, I think we should. I, cupcakes, we fit. I, I think, I think we should play the Magic School Bus theme song for our Z minus. Oh, that would be much better. <laughs> Devin, I would like that. Yo, SPT? Yo, SPT with the sub. Yo, we're good, bro. Oh, Yo, man, SPT long time. Fucking you, SPT. Freaking, freaking SPT in the Let's chat. Let's go. Man. Miss you, homie. One day, we yeah, will anyway. see you all in person again. Yeah. Uh, right now, a Pokemon. The, uh, villager. I haven't heard of Big Black Cupcakes, I don't know who this guy is. But he's in the winner's quarter, so. Welcome to Yellow Leaf. And he's chasing. I respect that so hard. Ch yeah, chase chase Villager all the way down there. <laughs> I respect that so hard. Especially for a character that can do it and recover safely, like, like he just did. That's good stuff. All right, deep breathing's on deck. Ooh, that was a little risky by Big Boy. Okay, and po Pokelab actually tried to bait that so hard. Um, th throwing out a couple of gyros to make him come in and just to bait with a punch but I'll smash. That was kind of good. It was a good attempt at the bait. Okay. All right, that's the throw. Here's the... That's a weird sun salutation. I think I that was like an accident turn around. Oh, can we talk about what Pokey Lamb just did? Can we talk about that? Mm. Uh, Pokey Lamb just threw the soccer ball, bounced off a shield, and grabbed the back and threw it again. Ooh. That was pretty that funny. Was, that, was, that was fancy uh, interaction. Ooh. I've never seen that before. Look, it looks like I need to put that. That's pretty cool. And right, and wow, the way. Pokelam is covering, covering center stage right now, and that's in, in oh my that was so smart because Wii Fit is a character that exploits the ledge so hard that if you crowd the ledge sometimes you just start to explode and Pokelam is like okay you know what I'll give you the I'll hold the center. Big boys. Zero to sixty four percent, zero to ninety percent uncontested. She is big. Big Boy just putting on all this heavy pressure near the ledge. It seems like every time Pokemon is off stage, he's not able to get back on stage without taking a hit or two. It's just devastating. And that said, though, slowly making the deficit close out. Yeah, he did it again. And like Pokelime is very comfortable with um, playing around with uh, Leaf and Soccer Ball. I also like the way in which uh, Pokelam places the tree, like covering the ledge, but also covering jump by throwing up back tears, bears, just making sure that he's always on the safe end and Leaf is kind of on the edge. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Big just dash checking, not caring, and Pokelam just not caring and throwing up the axe. Nobody cares right now. Ooh, okay. Oh wait. Okay, I know Devin knows what the three boys is going to do. <gasps> that was such a beautiful jab lock on though. I love it. Yeah. Wow. Uh, hello. Huh? Huh? Can you cue the Hannibal Baron with this? Oh, I'll try and get that going again. What happened? Did he just like fort? Uh, I don't know what happened. He had enough. Oh, he wanted to air dodge towards ledge. I mean, up he wanted to reach from there. Up he would have oh, been fine. Just okay. I see. Scared. It's unfortunate. Yeah, correct. Yes, yeah, Tempt is the goal. Then, and it's, it's funny because then you fall, he, he find out he's a small boy. Cool. Cross the Oh.
that young commentator screen? What does that mean? Uh, you guys want to do cams? <laughs> um, when I set up my stream shit, sure. Yeah, yeah. How do you even do that? Uh, Actually, yeah. as as we're streaming, I'll set it up because oh, uh, God. I'm I, gonna start streaming soon anyway. I so didn't I finish well setting up like the names, but I guess I could do that during the set. But I don't think Z minus can do it since he's literally commentating off of his goddamn cell phone. Yep. Yeah. Oh wait, you're, wait, are you actually on your cell phone? Yeah, iPhone 11. That works. It works. Like, we could use the camera on your phone and it would work fine. I, but then you wouldn't be able be to. Laggy. But then no, not that you wouldn't be able to talk into the microphone that's physically on your phone. Because like if you had a headset connected to your phone somehow, then that'd be good. I mean, I can talk from far. It's not a problem. Yeah, it's not I don't that know serious, if I though. want far D minus talking. Hey guys, you want to hear my commentary? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. I get it. Alright, I'm just gonna commentate this set. Alright, right now we have Pokelam at 90. Big Boy comes at 45. So we be getting the upper hand this time. Just yeah, not push um, forward as much. Yeah, another another quick start actually coming out from the cupcakes. Yeah, they got, he actually got up to a big start uh, game one too. And then Pokelam brought it back just like that. Just like this. <laughs> it was exactly like that. Wow. Ooh. Okay, man. I feel like Pokelam is definitely one of those players who has a very good grasp on their character and knows uh, like the cool downs of, of each move, right? Like the little gimmicks that your character can do, right? I thought that was going to be an action. Another thing. That was beautiful coverage. Because typically, a lot of the weak fits throughout that volleyball just make themselves safe. But right there, just stealing the volleyball, throwing out F smashers, just getting that really percent. Yeah. I think that was zero to death. Also. I think it was. It was really good, yeah. really impressive. Wow, this is this is actually a pretty quick game. Like both of these guys stocked just the back way. I feel like they just gave up and said, "You know what? It's time to play the game." So. I think Pokelam just wants to end it. He's like, you know what? I've had enough. Let's just let me just go body this wee fit. Oh! Oh! Wow! Wow! That was that would. You know, okay. okay. So what he just did? You saw that stuff in the soccer ball, right? Yeah, he did the beer reverse, and then he hit it towards the wall to ricochet into. I would have He has no chill, man. He ain't got no chill. Look at this. Look at this. Mmm. Then with the Smash 4 Classic. Get up attack until you got stage bike stupid. Jeez, that was really unfortunate. Because right here, I think he gets like an F tilt or something like that. Like just a really good kill. So F tilt. And then suddenly after the F tilt kill. Okay. Fair off stage. Yeah. Wait, did he get double zero? Oh wait. Well you guys that was a zero to death. This was a zero to death. That second stock from a Pokemon was zero to death. Oh. Well, I want to see it. Good. Yeah. And then the second stock. I mean, it might have been a long stock, but it was definitely zero to death. Yeah, it was just outplaying him in neutral. I feel like Villagers just has perfect tools to deal with Weef it off stage.